Okay, today is March 6th. Um, I wanted to uh, give you an update. Um, it was March 18th of last year that I had the uh, breast cancer surgery lumpectomy and I had my lymph nodes removed. Three of three were hot, which was um, a very big surprise for the doctors. Um, but um, they were removed um, and I chose proton radiation against the advice of uh, several different opinions, three different uh, places that I went, wanted me to do chemo and radiation. Um, I chose against the chemo, my heart, my um, inner being, which I've always listened to for people that know me, said no. Um, I also had the confidence of the doctor who uh, recommended the proton radiation and said that it would be fine. So I chose the proton radiation. I do have a little bit of issue with my lymphatics. Um, so I have a tactile medical machine which uh, massages the lymph nodes to get the fluid. Um, I use that once in a while. It was an everyday process. Now it's maybe once or twice a week. Hopefully it will go away for good, but I have that in case it's needed. Um, I do want to specify I had a scare um, the last three months. Um, were a little bit scary for me because of course I had my limb, my lung that was being uh, going to have to be checked on and my colon came back uh, so I had to have a colonoscopy uh, but everything came back great as of Thursday um, I had uh, my last CAT scan was uh, before that uh, and um, I just got the results on Thursday everything is great uh, everything is clear my lymph nodes look clear my lungs clear it's gone what they were looking at um, my uh, colonoscopy came back clean I don't they don't need to see me for another 10 years which uh, everybody that's had that done knows it's wonderful to hear that news um, also, you can do it without anesthesia. It was a painful procedure, but I chose to do it without the anesthesia. So it was like three minutes of hell. So, but I survived. Um, so if you can and you are willing, uh, I say give it a try. Um, breathe through it and you'll be okay. Um, I want to thank uh, my family, friends that were there, uh, people that rooted me on. I know some people might not have liked my choices. Uh, but again, I need to emphasize uh, cancer treatment is a personal choice. I reiterate, get second opinions, go out and research. And people don't understand this, but a hospital or a doctor's is only going to do what and offer what they can do unless you push. And even when you push, sometimes you might not get it. But research, see what else is out there. Um, I'm glad I did. I'm glad I had the faith in the proton radiation, um, but, uh, you know, it's, and, and people need to know it's nice to be there for people. Um, being alone is not a good feeling. Feeling like you're alone is not a good feeling. And um, being single, being uh, pretty much alone, it was tough at times, but uh, with my faith, uh, it helped. And with my friends and people reaching out that, uh, gave a hoot. It meant the world. So remember, people, don't be afraid to call them if you know that they had something going on. Don't be afraid to reach out if something's happening. I totally understand people have their lives and they have the things that they're going on with, but, um, and, and I hold myself accountable to doing that for people too. I don't hold it against people that don't have it in them. And, uh, but I do know it meant the world for me for the people that did care and the people that did reach out and the people that were there for me. So uh, not to go there uh, and get teary eyed, but um, thank you for those that were there. And remember, if anybody has people that can um, that are going through anything, reach out to them, be there for them, understand that they could be going through things that and they need you. So. Um, I think that's about it. Um, everybody, as of Thursday, I'm clear. The doctors know they probably won't see me for another 10 years because I believe in, in doctors, God's MRI. He tells me if something's going on and, um, he always has us go through experiences in our life. And, uh, and that's what they're for is to learn and to share with others. So I've shared.
And uh, uh, if something happens, I will update. Other than that, I'm doing great. Feel free to call if you know me. And uh, have a great one. Bye.